Beast at Fishing Nation. What's going on? It is Monday, July 3rd, 828. Ah, I got a habit of being about a half an hour behind schedule every time I'm trying to do something. So I wanted to get down for high tide, which is around 8.30ish, 8.42. Um, down where I fish, Avalon. I'm not going to play like I. you guys don't know where I fish. So I want to get the kayak out. I want to get up to a couple of the bridges there and um, take advantage of the high tide. See if I can... Um, grab some tog, maybe a sheep's head, get to learn this kayak a little bit, plus it's a no-wake zone there, um, so, you know, I can mess around in the no-wake zone, get my sea legs, hopefully don't roll, um, gonna give it a shot, so I got the kayak in tow, took me a little longer to get everything squared away, and I'll get a system down like I always do, uh, but in the meantime, this is all new, um, have great people to depend on, uh, great videos I've been watching. Uh, one guy I definitely depend on. And um, please, I ask you to uh, patronize his his business, Captain Hank's Tackle. And uh, Ed Gobo, one of my buddies on Facebook, the guy is an artist, an artist when it comes to tying jigs and and painting jigs and bucktails and I mean and they're deadly they are deadly so I'll put a link down below for you guys you can find them on Facebook Captain C-A-P-T period Hank's Tackle and he's on Facebook you can uh, reach out and you know place your orders this guy's a wonderful guy so and he's been a lot of help and it's appreciated Ed thank you so much brother so let's give it a shot see what we do and uh, again I'm a half an hour behind schedule uh, nobody in my area had sand fleas. I had to stop out at my buddy Chris's place, Tight Lines Bait and Tackle North, Bay Ave, Summers Point. They always have what you need. And if they don't, guarantee they'll get it. Alrighty, guys. Like, subscribe. Say your prayers to the man upstairs. Go yakking. I mean fishing. Shooby mistake number one. Look at that. The Mirage Drive went upside down. Pedals went through the hole. And then I couldn't get them out. It took me about 15 minutes. But I finally oh, got you got to be kidding me that that just happened. All righty, B-Stab Fishing Nation. I know you recognize these pilings by the bridge. I was hoping to get myself on the water as the tide, the high tide topped off and stopped for 45 minutes give or take and soak a couple sand fleas on a bottom sweeper jig and see if I can catch either a tog or maybe another sheep's head on my maiden saltwater voyage in my kayak unfortunately I got here about a half an hour to 40 minutes later than I wanted to, and the tide was already starting to run out. All right, guys, here we go. And the wind was coming out of the south at a hurried pace. However, I think the tide's already starting to, already the whole starting day to a little bit here. It was really oh, meant oh. to be on the water. Just ride it, baby. Just ride Getting the used wind. to waves, oh, getting used to. Pearl. Wind, getting used to the current, getting used to the kayak, see how it handles, wakes the whole nine yards. So, um, though I was late, though I fell behind, the day was still a plus. And there's been some fish caught from what I remember. Stay tuned. Definitely see where I could have used reverse already, but at the same point in time, you don't panic, you just let it, let it work. You know, let things work. <laughs> I definitely had a little little issue with my uh, little issue with my launch. I, I, believe it or not, the pedals went through the hole and then went sideways. I couldn't get them up. I could, 
and then there's no way to lift without anybody helping you i didn't have the i didn't have wheels and i still don't have the wheel chocks yet you know the dolly to get them up to lift this up so that was a little interesting this tide's already starting to run yeah i, might, I missed the high tide i think i missed the dead high it's okay Uh, it should be interesting. Mm. Just roll with it, baby. Roll with it. Bounce skate roll. I really am getting my sea legs on this thing. That's what today was all about. Um, again, it is the Hobie Revolution 13. It is about a 10, 11 year old unit. It's slender, it's narrow, and uh, it's not as stable as some of the wider models, but man, is this thing fast. Like this guy. Like there's just no reason for that. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, well that's a lesson learned. Definitely get a little water over the ass end of this thing or over the sides. One thing I learned about this particular model and uh, the fact that it is a 10, 11 years old, I am actually sitting in a well area um, on the deck itself and as opposed to on a chair seat that's raised a little bit where you could actually maybe slide a tackle you know tackle container under and man that bit of water came right over the side there a little bit over the gunnel and yep I got a wet ass cheek Getting to know you, getting to make sure I don't flip. <laughs> Sweet Jesus on the mountain top. <sighs> Crazy boaters make it stop. I imagine, I mean, listen, this, this water rips in here and it's going to start boogieing. So I missed the tide, so that's just, that's that. I, I absolutely missed the tide that I wanted to. Tide's running, no two ways about it, tide is running. Have my first fish. <laughs> oh boy, turn it in. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, Man, 
you get against that wall and there is no no breeze right that wall really blocks the breeze so what are we going to do we're going to nestle up bottom scans pretty cool man breeze is honking baby honky honky <laughs> scooby doo bop bop doo uh, let's see if we just catch anything coming through the bridge. Yep. Son of a gun. Son of a gun. I dream of Jeannie. She's a light brown hair. They're all dead. They're all D-E-D -E -D dead. Mm. Oh, whoa, look at the barnacles, the barnacles. Jeez, jeez Louise. What happened here? Avalon lady. The old man. Oh, shit. Hey guys, how are you? What's happening? Oh man. <laughs> That's awesome. I just met my buddy Jamie. He's an incredible sportsman. He stayed with me because I had to I had to try to get something retied here and oh I, I caught the rod behind me like a dipshit. Oh my goodness, he stayed with me as a uh stayed with me while a uh, boat was coming by left a you know pretty good wake nothing I couldn't handle but you definitely wanted to be nose into it because if I wasn't nose into it I might have been in bad shape I'll tell you this thing really it cuts baby it's a cutter all right let's see how we get into this here let's go into this boat's wake here now this isn't much of anything but this will help me learn wow cuts right through taking stuff sideways this breeze definitely picked up now it's going to be wind with tide so I'll get in here see what I can do Let's change this up a little bit. All right. See if we spot any fishies. I guess I'll turn around and drift with the tide, right? I mean, when in Rome, do as the Romans do. All sorts of fish down the bottom there, and rubble, and Barney. Hmm. I just I feel like I have to keep my head forward all the time so you know your melon your melons a lot of weight a lot of weight you gotta be careful oh right out of its mouth and still down there go oh, out of its mouth again Yep, stripped.
So far, so good, guys. A little nerve-wracking, little nuances. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. Problem is, these are big. These, these are some big. Oh, guys, first fish. First fish on the kayak. Croker, Croker Central. <laughs> first fish on the yak -a doodle Yak, yak -a doodle Now, how do I get you to fish off? <laughs> All right, first fish. Oh, keep your head still, dum dum. First fish on the kayak. Bottom sweeper jig. Thank you, buddy. You are now YouTube famous. Put a couple more of these up here. Just let them sit. Not a, there ain't a live one in this bunch. I guess that's the, that's the trick too. Leave them sit here. Oh, shoot. Oh, my goodness. Sorry. No wake. It's like a no crash zone. Nope. Mm. Fish number two. All right. All right, Croker. I'll see you, Croker. Croker, no joker. <laughs> Oh my god, they're small. What am I gonna do if I catch like something monstrous? Almost scream, shout, knock yourself out. Alright there, croaks. I'm trying to get you off of here. Without anybody getting cut and flared and zared and snared. Thanks for stopping. Seems like these croakers are stacked up in the deeper water. Or, or maybe not. Let's see. This is smaller. Smaller lure. Oh, there's a croaker. There's another one. Whoa, whoa, this guy's pissed. Boy, I wish I would have brought my lighter rod. What's up, guys? Got something there? Yeah, croaker. Filled. right now it's filled with croakers it's real weird we shouldn't see this until august yeah have fun <laughs> little fishy hey bud how you doing oh guys it's good it's a good size croaker it's good to be alive too good to be alive Croaker, bottom sweeper, sand fleas. So sand fleas, dead or alive, will definitely catch croakers. Prefer them alive if you're going to go for sheep's head. But I did watch people catch them with boiled, boiled uh, sand fleas. So there's that. <sighs> Hoagie fest is here. Sha -la 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 -la. All right. All right, I found me a hole, 26 foot of water. Guys, these are, these are, you know, this is where I fish, so. Oh, he's a half a, half a sand flea on there. Well, let's see what happens. Let him go. All right, there's a fish. Oh, croaker fest is here. I'd love to see something come up. Wobba da ba boom. Give him a smash. He's a croaker. He's croaking. And this is, you know what? With these little fish, is also teaching me how to land fish, deal with the fish, and uh, you know, also keep my head head about me while I'm out here. Ow, man! I'm trying to get you out, little buddy. Croaker fest. Oh yeah, felt myself going on that throw. No, but I was shooting for tog and uh, sheep's head, and of course, again, you, you're not going to do it getting down here at the wrong time. And I sure as hell 
that you get, get down here when I needed to. I needed to get down here a little earlier by about a half an hour, 45 minutes, so I could have just adjusted, you know. Oh, yeah, baby. Come on, croaks. Come on, croaker. Guys, I know this isn't flounder fishing. I know this isn't like, you know, some great catch and, and whatnot, but I'm having a blast. I'm learning something new. Um, my buddy from Captain Hank's Tackle, please, guys, please. If, you know, and I need to practice what I preach. I sincerely do practice what I preach. Buy some more stuff off of him. I just, I have so much stuff as it is. It's like, how much more can you have? But I'm telling you right now, his uh, his flounder his flounder uh, jigs oh my god they're deadly all right croaker fest is here scoop it boot up bay we're doing it we are doing it there we go Croaker from the deep. Croaker in 22 foot of water. Oh, he got wrapped up. Croaker in from the deep. Oh boy. I could definitely see where you're gonna take a lot of water in this thing. So you gotta make sure your hatches, everything's good to go, and closed and secure. But all good. Man, these bottom sweepers are deadly. Man, this tide's ripping through here. Mm. All righty. Oh, oh, let's see. What did I do? Lose it? Nope. I caught him. He's caught. So I will have to use a longer rod if I ever want to reach across the boat. That's for sure. Definitely need a longer rod. Because I do not have longer arms. Alright, here we go. Croaker Fest is here. Scoo -doo 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 -doo. All right, let's try and doing it this side now. Just say I can't reach around the boat. Just do it, I guess. All right, lay the rod down on my lap. Let the fish slap me in the face, you creep. Come on, buddy. Try not to get jacked here. Man, you ate that down. Just what I wanted you to do. All right, awesome. All right, that worked, guys, that worked. All right, I got one more. Let's use one more. What do you think? It's going good. Be stab fishing. We're going to take it out from here because my battery's almost done. Like, subscribe, say your prayers to the man upstairs. Let me know if you think I should be doing anything different, what I'm doing right, what I'm doing wrong, and any suggestions you have. Get yourself off the couch. Happy 4th of July. Go fishing. There we go. Croaker Fest. Get out of there. All right. That'll do it. Yeah. Like you. Son of a gun. Boop.